Assistant Mayor Dana Ralph, and we are at Big Woo Fitness today. I'm so excited to be here. Wu, would you introduce yourself for me? Hi, my name is Willa Wusefa. Originally, I'm from Liberia. We are located on the west coast of Africa. Tell us a little bit about Big Woo Fitness. We offer personal training classes. We offer group classes. We offer kickboxing classes and circuit training classes. I specialize in training athletes. 80% of my clients are basketball players. I've seen the videos <laughs> where the kids can jump from here to up here, and I do not know how that works. So exactly. It's amazing to me. And, and Mayor, you'll be surprised. Most of our clients, they come from like Bellevue, Sumner, all over, even Ken, right? So Ken, Ken is like our middle ground. Athletes from all walks of life, right? We are located right downtown Ken, right on Maker Street. We are like family, right? Everyone is welcome here. Love it. It's a bright spot in the middle of downtown for sure. When the COVID restrictions came back in March, what was the impact on your business? It really hit us hard. Uh, financially because we were closed for three months on the first shutdown. We didn't have any, any income coming in, right? But when we reopened, we had to adjust to a lot of rules and regulations. As you can see on this floor here, we got all our boxes for kickboxing classes. So we got social distancing boxes to keep our clients safe. We had to sanitize every equipment. So we just had to really adjust to a whole lot of things. But you were able to do that. You were able to implement some of those things. And so even, even if it was for a short time, we're now back in new restrictions. And so are you guys closed down again? Yeah, we closed down again. Boom. We want to keep our clients safe, our citizens safe, and, and, and everyone that could be impacted. It's that hard balance between economy and, and health. And sometimes, like with Big Woo Fitness, those two things intersect, right? Having people being able to get out and exercise does help keep them healthy. Exactly. City was able to offer just over $2 million to small businesses in the city of Kent through some of the relief we received from the federal government. How did you hear about that application process? Actually, it was from three different platforms. The first platform was from the Ken Downtown Partnership. They sent an email. The Ken Chimers also sent an email. And we looked on your website. And that grant really helped us fund our payroll, pay our trainers, pay our rent, pay our lights. So we are very thankful to the city of Ken. We're really happy to be able to tell some of the stories of what that grant money was able to do. And everything you just said was the goal of those grants, right? It was to help people people keep their lights on, keep their employees employed, because we have to get through this together. Exactly. I will tell you, I'm really, really proud that Big Woo Fitness calls downtown Kent home. Proud of all the work that you and all of your amazing trainers have put in to help make our community safe. And thanks for taking the time today to have this conversation and tell us a little bit about your plans. I wanna end on something positive. Once we get through COVID, right? Once we get to take our masks off and start hugging each other again, what are your plans for Big Woo Fitness. I'm looking forward to seeing a big kickboxing class, a big circuit training class, hugging all our clients. But right now yes. we can't do that. Right now we're doing face bombing and stuff. So I'm just looking forward to just showing the extra love that we can show by hugging and face bombing and having a bigger class. I have taken a class or two here and worked with my fabulous trainer, Lisa. Of course. Uh, I just want to say thank you for being such a, an open and welcoming business. And I was really excited that through this grant process, we were able to provide some grant money to Big Woo Fitness. Yes, thank you, Mayor. Thank you.